That's cool. We, at the very least, have a more cloaking system. And, of course, there's a store. Yeah. I'm almost considering I should probably jump down through here once I've gone to the store. Because this quest is over here as well. I think I'm going to go ahead and do that. There's only one other ship at this beacon, and it's showing heavy damage. You receive a message. Greetings, traveler. We were crippled by a band of pirates and are now forced to sell our remaining valuable equipment. Let's see what you got. You got shields. Yeah, I don't have enough for that. Oh, I can get drone control. Ugh, drone control. Um, I thought... Well, maybe it's another ship that can't do that, but I know there's, like, one ship that either can't do the crew teleporter or the drone control. I just don't remember which ship it is. I don't really have anything to sell. I suppose I could get rid of this. Um, it's only a 15% chance to negate stuff anyway, but that's not enough to get shields. And even if it was, I don't have the power for it. Hmm. Hmm, indeed. The repair arm could be nice, though. Because we could uh, we could always use a little bit of extra repairs. Um, this is probably real stupid, but I think I might actually get rid of this. Because technically the hull still gets damaged, and the only thing it does is negate um, possible damage to systems, I believe. So we're going to get rid of that. That might have been stupid, but I'm going to get a repair arm instead. And this repair arm will uh, repair our ship every time that we get a little bit of scrap, which is kind of nice. I can't go there. Because one, I think I would be within this, and two, if I do that, I ruin the achievement possibility. So the only thing I can do is jump through the quest beacon and... Or jump to the exit and then to the quest beacon. But I think the exit might actually be within this. If I do that, this could be really bad. This could be really bad. Alright, let's see here. We've got a dilapidated space station, apparently, and there's some kind of faint life signatures. Let's uh, look for survivors, shall we? All around, it's just death and decay. Life sign readings must have been a malfunction. Oh well, we get some scrap out of it. Yeah, I'm pretty sure they are going to cover the exit beacon. I'm going to go for the quest. I'm going to risk it. I'm going to risk it. If this if this doesn't work somehow, then I'm going to head on back. After a quick search, we discovered the Federation space dock, and they offer us some supplies. I'm getting a lot of drone stuff. Oh, God, this is going to be bad. Um, if I die here, I'm just going to restart this, and <laughs> we'll go through again and see what happens that time. But this could be very... Very bad. Very bad. We've just hit the exit beacon, but they got here first. That's bullshit. They weren't here first. I got here first. Okay. And they don't have any sort of teleporter. That laser's kind of fast. I don't like that. Watch out. Actually, that's just one laser. I should wait for this missile. I don't care about the laser so much. Ooh, maybe I did care about that laser. Jeez, how did that cause fire like that? That's ridiculous. Why don't you go over here, because I don't need my weapons right now. Mainly, I need my engine. Whoa. Let's cloak. Oh, God, that's a big missile. I'm not even going to bother fighting this. I just want my engine back. Oh, my God, this fire is so bad. I should have stopped this from coming in here. I don't know if I'm going to be able to uh, get rid of this. Nope. I didn't have enough time. This is very bad. Is that like a fire laser or something? No. It just got a really lucky shot. Oh, this is bad. Alright, I'm going to need to vent this because this is not working out. Quickly, vent as fast as you possibly can. Oh boy, that's gonna hurt. Ugh. Now I can't see if the fire's there. This is ridiculous. Okay, I need this repaired. This is bad. Really bad. He's getting fired and losing oxygen and everything. Okay, you go here. 
Um, it looks like my weapons are on fire. That's that's fantastic. I don't really care about the weapons being on fire. I need to get the frick out of here. Um, also, I should close these doors up because there's no reason for those to be open currently. I will, however, open these and hopefully get some oxygen uh, going around the ship. This one didn't have any oxygen in it anyway, so why do I care? You are going here. You might die before you make it to the med bay. I don't know. Cloak, please. Oh, god damn it. Of course. Of course that is exactly what would happen, isn't it? Damn it. I wish that cloak was longer. Okay, we need the engine. Screw the oxygen for now. Screw it all. That's still closed, so that should keep the fire from coming through. Okay, we're getting the engine back. However, we are also about to get hit really hard. <laughs> Pain! Pain and suffering! This is so bad. Okay. It's okay. We're getting the hell out of here. <laughs> oh god. We we are uh we're pretty well burnt here. Um Yeah, rock controlled sector, that sounds like a great idea. Um You know what? I'm gonna go through the NG controlled sector. There's um probably not much we're going to find here of any use right now. But right now it is a slightly friendly sector, which is good. We're going to go and repair this. I know there's fires going on right now. Oh, crap. The O2. Never mind. You know what? We are going to go for the O2. I bet you there's a fire in the O2 and everything. No, nope, there's no fire there. Okay, we're good. I just need this O2 back before bad things start happening. All right, everyone... Go repair that med bay. In fact, we'll be back after I uh, repair this ship, which is uh, imminently going to be destroyed. Yes. Well, we're uh, back up and running. We're pretty worse for wear at the moment, but um, at the very least, we got some scrap, I suppose. Let's see what's around before I do anything. Um, pretty open sector right now. Doesn't look like much of anything to head for. I was hoping there would be a store because we could really use the uh, the repairs right now. <laughs> That's okay. We'll, we'll get a few repairs from jumping around, I imagine. Um, I don't want to put the cloak up another one just yet. I think I'm going to save my scrap for now. We're going to head up here and um, the hope is we don't die. Oh, hi. Hi, scrap and system repair drone. Uh, that's, that's cool. Just a random, friendly aid station. That's, that's very nice. We got a little bit of health back from that. So that's just a, uh, repair drone. If we had a drone bay, I guess that would be cool, but we don't really have anything like that right now. Let's see what we got over here. Federation encrypted signal. Let's investigate. And we have found uh, another one talking about a secret base. We're just finding all the secret bases today, apparently. That's really close to the exit marker, so that's nice. Oh, store. Thank you, store. I've been looking for you for all my life of five seconds. Yes. Ooh, Zoltan. Um, I don't really want to spend my money on a Zoltan, considering that I need to repair my ship, but at the same time there's a heavy laser. Oh, baby, I want you heavy lasers. Um, it's a nine charge here. What is mine? Ten. But this uh, requires two power, doesn't it? No, one power. That's actually pretty nice. And I can sell this off. Getting fifteen. I'm gonna grab this laser because this is actually um, pretty nice. It's not going to be able to get rid of uh, a dual shield, but it uh, it could help us to do some extra damage. That would be nice, and we'll repair as much as we can. And uh, whatever's left, we'll 
get with other things, I guess. This heal beam would be cool, but, um, or heal burst, I guess. It would be cool, but I really don't have the, uh, the money for it, and the S-bomb would be also pretty cool. Um, the only problem with, uh, bombs like this is it only damages systems and not the hull, so you're not actually destroying the ship. Which is a problem. Oh, we don't have enough power for it? I didn't even think about that. Silly me. Whatever, we'll, uh, we'll probably get some scrap to, uh, power that up really quickly. So it doesn't matter. Oh, hello. We arrive at a distress beacon near a small asteroid belt and find a ship with pirate markings crushed between two rocks. We'll use our beam weapon to carefully cut them out. And using our beam weapon to make the precision cuts, the ship gets away and uh, the rock crumbles away as well. They thank us and offer us some crap. I like crap. And it's not enough. Damn it. Aw, oh, man. Alright, um... I think I'm gonna head down this way, because I want to get away from this while also hitting this quest marker. And there's a couple different things around here as well. So even if we do miss a few markers, that's fine. All right, let's see here. Distress call from an NG ship. Assistance required, danger present. Well, let's respond. We receive another message from the ship. This time with a mantis at the comm log. Foolish meat sacks, he yells. Sensors indicates the ship is moving into attack, and we've got some teleporters boarding. Great. How the hell do they board us? They don't even have a teleportation system. I call bullshit. That is, that is total bullshit. Um, let's see here. I'm going to let this one guy have at it for a moment, and we'll see how things go. He's definitely not going to be able to beat the Mantis, considering that he doesn't have um, the Mantis's capabilities to fight, but that's fine. I'm going to send in some backup for him. Alright, we got one shot coming our direction. I'm going to go ahead and cloak for the moment. Because the last time that I didn't cloak for a single shot like that, we got set on fire and it was a bad, bad situation. And I really just don't want that to happen again. You know, technically, I could just power that baby down and power you up. And I think I'm going to do that for now. Alright, we've almost got this mantis off of here. I'm going to hit your shield with the dual lasers. Alright, and um, if we're lucky here, we should be able to hit three systems. Nice. Yeah, I got one too, asshole. What do you think about that? Okay, I'm gonna send this guy in and switch you out of here. And you're gone. Sweet. That worked out pretty well, and uh, we'll send our dual laser here. And mini beam should be ready pretty soon here. We are taking a little damage, but um, nothing too severe. I think I'm just going to air this out. And we shall mini-beam the rest of you. Get the hell out of here. Jerks. Alright, please air that out before that fire actually does damage. That would be so nice right now. In fact, why don't you two go in there I'm going to take a little damage, but okay, that's fine. I'll just close all those doors, and uh, hopefully they'll get air before they die. Cool. Looks good to me, and we'll be back right after they repair. So we've been having a few close claws here and there, but um, I think we've been doing okay for this ship uh, not being the easiest ship to work with. I'm also going to get some power here, and now we can power ourselves up fully. And I like that. That is cool. Um, oh, there's a store up here. I'd like to go to the store, but I don't have any scrap at the moment, so it's not a not a really good thing to go to. And if I go here, they're going to be on me pretty quick. I don't know which one I should go to. 
Uh, I think I'm just going to go to this distress beacon. Yes. Because then I can go through here into there. I, I think that'll be okay. I want to see what's at the distress beacon. Let's see if we got anything. A ship without life forms within a nearby dense asteroid field is giving off a distress call. Shall we investigate? Could be dangerous. Sure, let's search for the ship. You find the decaying remains of some kind of ship coated with ice or crystal. You send some crew aboard to explore. Nearly everything is either destroyed or unidentifiable. But one of the weapons appears to be salvageable. There's a strange stasis pod that catches your eye. It looks like a massive asteroid is in a direct collision course with the derelict ship. You have to pull your crew out, but they want to grab what they can first. What do they take? We're going to take the stasis chamber. Yes. The crew drags the pod back to your ship before the asteroid smashes into the ship and shatters through the crystal coating, destroying the ship. We got 17 scrap out of it and a damaged stasis pod. So the damaged stasis pod is going to take up this thing here which is kind of a pain in the ass because that means we can't get anything else but um it's kind of uh just gonna sit there for now this bizarre alien artifact appears to be barely operational it has no practical function but perhaps someone can repair it yeah i i don't know if we're going to be able to do what you're supposed to be able to do with this thing but you know what i am going to try really hard those of you who know exactly what this thing does, you're probably squeeing right now because you know it's awesome. Those of you who don't know what it does, just sit back and maybe we'll find out. Alright. Oh, what? What? Are you serious? Okay. Wow. Um... We literally just stumbled onto the best thing we could have found. Uh, okay, here we go.